Hello there, toaster heads. Today I woke up out of bed. A huge accomplishment for me if I do say so myself. After I woke up from bed I went over to my computer and saw I was gifted a game. This is the first time Purple Chef has ever gotten a gift, so I had to look up on Google what to do with it. Inside was a game called I Am Bread. I was unsure what to do because I thought it was a gift, but then it said it was bread. After freaking out about whether it was a gift or bread I went over to Fail Boots house to ask him what I should do. He said, Please don't come in my house. I then came back three months later to ask again. Why are you in here? Get out! Purple Chef! Why? It's been like five minutes since you knocked. Just play the game. Someone probably sent it to you to play like on your channel or something. Besides, like, isn't the whole purpose of that game like to get into a toaster? Purple Chef? Where'd you go, buddy? But it was too late for me to hear him because I was already home loading up the game. Then I pressed record. And then I said hello there toaster heads. Today I woke up out of bed. A huge accomplishment for me if I do say so myself. After I woke up from So now I'm here ready to play I am bread. Even though I am not bread, do not get confused like Purple Chef did. Oh boy, I cannot wait to get started. Not many people know this about Purple Chef, but Purple Chef really loves toasters. They are so warm and they make great room decorations. They also make really great lights when they light on fire. I'm so excited to play. I know this game will be so easy for me since I have so much practice doing the same thing in real life. Oh golly what is that thing? It looks so derpy. Ah, who's a good smiling goat? You are. Yes you are. Let's get started. Now the gift says it is loading. I thought it was bread. Whoa, that bread was moving way too fast for me to read it. Well, it looks like our first step into the world was a flop. <laughs> Come on, baby bread thing. Let us go find the toaster so we can hop inside of it. Oh golly! Our bread is ripped! This must be the strongest bread in the world! Oh golly! Hold on bread friend! Oh dear you have small bean things on you! That is no good! How is this bread so strong? Oh golly I guess it wasn't that strong! Oops! Wait now the game is telling me that it isn't bread. What am I supposed to believe anymore? Well now we're really in a jam, aren't we? <laughs> yes I probably deserve that one. Oh what is that shining butter thing? I may not know a lot about butter, but I do know it doesn't glow as brightly as Notch's well-polished bald head. Oh looky purple chef's bread is sparkling like Mario. Let's-a go. Oh no not again. Oh wait. The star thing stopped my bread from being dirty. If stars stop dirt then outer space must be really 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 clean. Golly! 
Wall climbing takes so much time from Purple Chef. I wish it could go faster. There we go, that was much better. Perfect landing. Purple Chef was always told as a child to hit things with your head until they're fixed. This Jenga thing is putting up a big fight though. But in the end Purple Chef wins this battle. There it is watchers. We are almost there at the toaster. What Purple Chef has been waiting for. Although Purple Chef must say that we look grosser than Muscle Man's butt on Taco Tuesday. Almost in. Not there yet. Alright we go on top of the toaster. The next step should be easy as cake. I'm actually very hungry right now from looking at all this bread. I wish Purple Chef had cake nearby. Jump bread jump. That's okay bread, just a bit far. Oh no. Bread wait no. Oh golly this is bad. Thank you Mario Stars from saving us from poop. Alright, easy now. Just a little push. No way. Well, that was not a little anything. Purple Chap is beginning to get mad at Mr. Breadman. We are so close. Purple Chef thinks it is because of eggs and potato chips. Purple Chef thinks we may have to start over to get in the toaster. It is okay toaster heads. We will get in the toaster this time. Purple Chef likes the bright butter. However Purple Chef wants to make it into toaster without it. Purple Chef believes in Purple Chef. Oh golly Purple Chef did not believe hard enough. Okay Purple Chef must get past big box of potato chips without picking up any potato chips. Oops. Well at least it is only one potato chip. Oh golly. That was close. We didn't pick up any potato Purple Shep is starting to not like this game. Purple Shep feels like Chippy Ninja Bread. Purple Shep is so close to toaster. With fully eatable bread. Oh no. Not like this. Oh golly. Get back up Mr. Bread. Oh golly I think Purple Shep has lost wool over that. Here we are again. I love the inside of toasters, and have been in them many times, but Purple Chef cannot seem to get this bread and potato chips inside the toaster. The potato chips must be evil. These are evil potato chips that do not want Purple Chef to use the toaster. Purple Chef has been trying over and over and over again but cannot get the bread in the toaster. These potato chips are making Purple Chef very angry and Purple Chef does not act right when angry. Purple Chef is so close. This is not fair to Purple Chef or to the toaster head watchers. Oh no not again. I am sorry Breadman. We will try one more time again. Okay Purple Chef will be super duper careful not to touch the evil potato chips again. Good so far. Perfect. Purple Chef did not touch any of the potato chips this time. Potato. Potato. Potter 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 This is it Toaster Heads. This has to be the one. The evil potato chips are trying to keep us down, but we cannot let the potato chips break us. 
We must not give up and get angry. We must win. We must enter the toaster and become toast. Oh golly. Oh golly, oh golly. We did it. We actually did it. Purple Chef put the bread in the toaster. This is happiest day of Purple Chef's life. Purple Chef cannot believe this. Purple Chef is never having potato chips ever again. They are pure evil who tried to stop the Toaster Head Nation. But we did it. Thank you all for watching Purple Chef's glorious victory at getting in a toaster. I think I am going to go jump in a few toasters now as a reward. I do not know who sent me this game, but thank you very much for doing that as the box smells very nice, and the game was very very fun once I actually got into the toaster. The toaster head viewer should tell Purple Chef in the comments what other games they would like to watch Purple Chef play. I will be starting to play games with other people soon unless they run away from Purple Chef's ugliness more. Thank you toaster heads for being so nice and awesome. I will see you on Saturday. Goodbye.